worldwide. So, welcome, Rasmus Jarbrecht. Thank you. Thank you, Alan, for that kind introduction. Um, and thank you, Rio and Alan, for inviting me here today. It really is a pleasure to be back in Estonia. I was telling uh, our driver on the way here that you know, I spent uh, a week on Hioma uh, a couple of summers back, and I always say yes when I'm invited to come back to your beautiful country. So I am a head of uh, strategy, and I run what we call front office digitization for SEB Group. That's a weird title, and it includes a lot of things. Digital banking, how we connect to our customers. Rapid process digitization, how we do things faster and cheaper. Big data analytics, how we use all the information we have. And finally, of course, innovation, the reason we're all here today. Both employee innovation, which we run in our lab, but also fintech venture capital, when we invest in other people's innovation. And we have made four such investments so far, none yet in Estonia, and we hope that's gonna change during 2017. We are actively looking for interesting fintechs to partner with. But we're here to talk about innovation. And over 160 years ago, a man by the name of Andre Oscar Wallenberg had a very innovative idea. Sweden's first privately owned corporate bank. And so SEB was founded in the service of enterprise to help Swedish companies get started, to grow, and to expand beyond our borders. And as they did so, as they grew into the world, SEB grew with them. And today they are all international giants. You know them as Ericsson, AstraZeneca, Scania. But of course, back then, they were just startups, like many of the companies here today. And that is why SEB firmly believes that entrepreneurial minds and innovative companies truly do make the world a better place. Estonia, like Sweden, has a proud heritage of innovation. Some of Europe's fastest growing and most innovative companies were founded right here in Tallinn. But your innovation is not limited to the private sector. I think the Estonian government showed with its e-citizenship a few years back, what it truly means to think outside the box and show the rest of the world what's possible through public and private partnerships. And that's very important because, like Sweden, Estonia is a small country in Europe and has always had to be a little faster and a little smarter than its larger neighbors. And so it will come as no surprise that SEB's head of innovation globally is an Estonian, Mart Masik. And for the last year or so, he has run our innovation lab for employees in Stockholm. And before that, he ran an innovation lab for employees here in Tallinn. And this is where we capture all of the creativity of our employees and make sure that we can sort of bring that on board and then release new ideas and services to our customers. But we wanted to take it one step beyond that. We wanted to take all of this and also give those ideas back to our customers. So last month we launched the SEB Greenhouse in Stockholm to help small and medium-sized enterprises grow and expand their businesses. We call them scale-ups. And today, of course, we're here to open the very first innovation center right here in Tallinn. So why is SEB, why is a bank a good partner for innovation? Well, as the winds of change have blown through the banking sector, spurred by new customer behavior and new customer demands, by ever more stringent regulation, but perhaps most importantly by the possibilities of new technology, SEB has really had to embrace innovation in order to remain a relevant partner to our clients. And through all, all of this, we have learned some pretty simple lessons, lessons like always focusing on the customer need and the behavior to truly understand what's needed, not just guessing. Lessons like getting out of the building in order to gain a new perspective on things. Lessons like focusing on the minimum viable product needed in order to maintain speed. Because like in other things, speed is absolutely crucial when it comes to innovation. So now we want to take all of these lessons and many more like them we want to share them with you, our clients. 
in order to help you grow your businesses faster and better, to expand them beyond Estonia's borders, and also to give our private customers a chance to get a glimpse of what we think the banking of the future could look like. So today, right here, is a celebration of innovation. At SEB, we firmly believe that innovation is not something you do on your own. We think innovation is something best done in partnership, learning from each other, experimenting and prototyping, even failing fast if that's necessary, but always with somebody there to pick you back up once you have fallen. And we want SEB to be that partner. I'm very proud of what Rio and Alan and my colleagues here have achieved in opening this innovation center, and I hope we will make all of you proud of us as well as we go forward. Thank you. Thank you, Rasmus.